MIT and Harvard are separated by just a few bends of the Charles River. The two Cambridge neighbors have produced plenty of history over the centuries, and tonight they'll make a little more. Live water polo coverage comes to Nesson for the first time ever. It's the 123rd matchup between the Engineers and the Crimson. For Harvard, the man of the weekend has been James Rosales Hill, who yesterday broke the Crimson's all-time scoring record as a seven-goal barrage helped propel the Crimson to a win over Brown. Couldn't have just been a one-goal game for Rosales Hill. He has to put an emphasis on just how great he is. We can see him now on the screen clapping it up with Tyler Zarku, and he's looking to repeat his performance today. But for the Crimson, their offense is more than just Rosales Hill. This is a team that scores a lot, and they have a lot of players who can hurt you. Absolutely. They are a deep team this year, starting all the way with their freshman class. Three great recruits. Dean Strasser had a great weekend last weekend, looking to get some more shooters on today, and Oliver Price will be getting a start in the goal. A long pass up ahead for Rosales Hill. Let's see if he calls his own number. He does, and it's a 1-1 game as Rosales Hill can Throwing that into the corner forces the offense to not have as advantageous of a counterattack. And Harvard takes the lead. Tyler Hogan, the first year from Atherton, California, connect. Works it in the interior, and that's Mott Stoddhart. This is Captain Mott Stoddhart not to shoot that ball. He knows he has so much clock left. And there's a score from Dean Strouser with the left arm. And Harvard tries to attack what's been a feisty MIT defense at the start of this contest. And how about that? Long distance dedicated. Hale running things again from the outside. That's two in a row for the senior. There's not a huge other Harvard captain. Gets it back over to Rosales Hill. Bila Sogar Sri Krishnan. His first of the day, number 16 of the engineers. Got a big prize next weekend. Is there's a block? Would it go through? Up top, there's a shot from distance, and the second goal of the game for Tyler Hogan. Great look passes from the Crimson. Getting very crafty with it. There's a quick fire shot and a score for Strouser, his second of the game. They get it inside, and boy, Berghardt makes that look easy on the pass from Sotatze. And Harvard converts in the six on five. 14. Yeah. Minnis made it a point to emphasize how James isn't racking up these goals and just. As there's Sotatze, his second. Difference between the shot and game clock about 10, 11 seconds. Great quick find, Berghardt hat trick. Jack Berghardt continues to. Great look here. And, and he, he scores. scores. You said it, I said it. Goal number one of the season for Rishi Mohan. He had four last year and the senior from Dallas puts the Crimson on top by 13, their biggest lead of the game. That was a dirty shot. It's with communication from the center defenders and it's Labrador with a beautiful shot. That's his second career goal. Emil Labrador. In a matchup of Cambridge rivals, the Crimson continue to stay hot to start the season in conference play. Harvard wins its eighth in a row with a 21-9 win over MIT.